Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I have another Amazon, another Amazon video for you guys. So this is more for, I guess, desk organization. Okay guys, so I've been editing the video today and I realized that throughout the video, I say organization a lot and this is not an organizational video. This is more of a video of things that you need if you wanna go back to school or if you work from home, things that you may need, right? Um, so I'm sorry that I'm saying organization a lot throughout this whole video. I'm so, so, so sorry, but I hope you understand. So let's go back to the video now. So if you're into Amazon and you like to buy Amazon things, then go ahead and keep watching. Okay, so the first thing I want to talk about is a mouse pad. So the first thing I want to talk about is a mouse pad. Um, it's right over here. I'm going to insert a close-up of it since I can't physically show it to you guys Well, I can but I don't want to Yeah, I'll just insert a video of it. It'll be cool. Okay, so I really like this mouse pad because it's really really long and um, I'm trying to transition into a more neutral neutral type of color even though you can't really tell what I'm trying to um, so I really enjoy this mouse pad and uh, there's different colors. I don't remember how much it costs, but I'll, I'll do my best to try and figure out how much it was. Okay, so the second thing that I want to talk to you guys about is this acrylic stand. So do you see it? It is, I think, it's so, so, so beautiful. It just looks so elegant and it looks less cluttered on your desk. So if you're working from home or if, you know, I know everyone's starting online school in most states, I think, I think. Go ahead and pick yourself one of the, pick up one of these for yourself. They are a little bit on the pricier side. I think it was about $50. So that's like the only bad thing. But other than that, I think it's beautiful and I really enjoy having it. Third thing I want to talk about is a keyboard. So it is a wireless keyboard keyboard Bluetooth to be more specific um, I recently bought this just because I got the stand to put my laptop on and I didn't want to be like this while I was typing so I decided to get a wireless one that's that kind of looks like the Apple one but not really so it's right here sorry about that I can't really see I'll put a close-up of it on the screen but I really like it um, it feels very smooth. Uh, I went through a whole bunch and saw which one was more appealing, which one had, had better reviews, and I really like this one, and it works perfectly fine. Okay, so the next thing I want to talk about is this mouse. So I just want to kind of give it a close-up, hopefully. Do you guys see how pretty that is? Um, it's soundproof or clickless. I don't know what the term is, but... You could barely hear the clicking sound and it's just it just looks so luxurious and I really like it and plus it matches the whole white thing that I'm trying to go for for my little desk so it's pretty nice okay, so the next thing I want to talk about I think this is the fifth thing I'm not too sure so the next thing I want to talk about is this laptop case here okay, just so you guys can see it looks a little different on the screen, but it's kind of like like a tan rose color. And I have the MacBook Air. I've had this laptop for about six, seven years. So I'll uh, make sure to link all the stuff that I bought down below. So if you want to purchase them too, you can go ahead and do that as well. So this is going to be a short video just because I don't have a lot of stuff to talk about. Sorry. And then some of the stuff that I have on here, they're not from Amazon, they're from Target. And this is an Amazon haul, so I didn't think it was relevant to add those on there. But if you wanna know where I got everything on my desk, just let me know and maybe I'll make a desk tour video if that's what you guys wanna see. So the last thing that I wanna talk about, not the iPad, but this stylus pen. So I have this iPad, I think it's the mini iPad either second or third generation, I'm not too sure. And 
everyone so I wanted to buy a stylus pad that can help me with my digital planner that I just got into which I will show you guys once I'm done talking about this but I really like it so I'm gonna give it a close-up so you guys can see it's just it just looks very very luxurious and it snaps on and off do you see that I really like it I had bought in another one and it was nice too, but I just preferred this more sleek version of it. So if you have an older generation iPad or anything like that, then pick one of these up. Okay, so before I conclude this video, I wanna show you guys how the stylus pen works on my mini iPad. Well, techni technically it's not mine, it's my husband's, but I'm using it. Um, I'm trying to convince him to get me a newer version so let's see how that goes. I'm gonna show you guys the app that I use for it and um, what agenda I downloaded. Just, just stick around, stick around. Okay, so I'm trying to do it with one hand, so let's see how it goes. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and click on that. Takes a little bit to load, I don't know why, maybe because it's an older generation, I'm not too sure. Okay, so this is a digital planner that I use. It's called Hustle St. Lee, the leopard print, and it's by, I believe her name is Jessica. I'm not too sure. I'll have some of her YouTube videos linked down below. She makes really, really cute planners and stickers and other inserts as well. So if you're into the whole digital um, planning then go ahead and just look her up she's actually really cool I really like her and I also have this notebook she has a lot of freebies on her website so if you go to her website you'll be able to enter a code um, and then you could download a lot of the freebies that she has on there so I'm gonna go ahead and click on this so it does take a little to load but I'm okay with that I don't mind waiting okay so if you can see um, I usually use the daily ones just when I know I have a lot of things to do like for today I have a lot of things to do but when you select so let me turn this off so you'll be able to help me select so I'm gonna select September because that's what I've been um, that's what I've been decorating a little bit more so it's not fully done yet but I just want you guys to see how cool it is so you can do a lot of things so you can write on it uh, you can put stickers in it it's just really really cool and so if you would like to see how I I guess do my digital planning and what I use please let me know I am new to all this digital planning stuff, but I'm slowly learning and I'm hoping that when and if I get a new iPad, I can do a lot more things and be able to share that with you guys. So again, thank you so much for watching. Let's continue on to the regular video where I say bye to you. Okay. Bye. Guys, so that is it for today's video. Um, I hope you got some inspiration on how you can make your desk or your study space a little bit more organized, I guess you can say, and give it a thumbs up and comment down below if you would like to see a desk tour or not, and I would be more than happy to make another video. Thank you so much for clicking on the video, and thank you so much for just coming on here to see what I have to say. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much, and have a good day. Until next time.